Hello everybody, welcome back. It's Raven here again, and we are checking out the DFN Odysseus by Flying Debris. And I don't know that he's here at the moment, but we're gonna check out the ship anyway because he did leave it here, so we'll just do a quick review. Um, looking around, it, it does have a nice uh, silhouette to it, but I would say, like, back here, these could use some wedges. Um, I know he's in chat, so he may respond, in which case, cool. Um, I like the engines. I don't know if I would use lava or ice crystal on them, but I do like them. See, the thing is that he's got ice crystal up here, so it's a kind of... It's kind of tricky. Um, who is flying that thing? Go ahead and take a look through the inside really quick. So he's got he's broken up the hallway already with the red lines. That's nice. It helps just kind of make it not so. Yeah. Um, got a couple power rooms or power storage rooms sort of thing. Pretty cool. That works. Let's see, ooh, asymmetrical. Looks like computer room sort of thing going on here. I like it. I like it a lot. Definitely nice. And then we got a nice long hallway with some uh, some wedging here on the bottom. I don't know how I feel about this bottom wedging. It's not bad um, necessarily. It's just I don't know how well it fits. It, it does kind of make the hallway claustrophobic and you can get caught on it but it's hit or miss. It's not necessarily a bad thing. Um, I'm assuming either... Yeah, this looks like a bedroom with storage lockers on top. Haven't seen the storage lockers on top before. I like it. And sorry about the silence in the background. Another crew quarter in the back. Cool. So go ahead and zoom back down. Head on up here. Um... Looks like a hollow table. Nicely done. Um, although I would break up the lights over the hollow table, or over the table then, and to differentiate it a little bit better, it may end up helping. Not entirely sure. Yeah. Uh, this looks like an officer or captain type quarters with plenty of storage. Um, nice. And I like the fact that he moved the red line up top a little bit more. That's that's pretty cool. Let's see, is it mirrored on the side? Yep. So I'm assuming officers type quarters instead of captain's quarters. Exactly. So let's go ahead and pop on up. Um, bridge, I assume. Maybe make it a little bit more grandiose or put like a computer in somewhere to show that you can control the ship from here. But other than, and maybe some wedges right here, that might help. Just sort of make it pop out a little bit better. Um, let's see. Sorry about the voice crack. I'm getting a little tired, but that's alright. Uh, let's see. I think there's something back here. Maybe? Okay, core. We've got our couple gravity units and it looks like the faction modules in front of the core so that's good protection and then I'm assuming weapons computer um, maybe it's just because I'm sort of a stickler for symmetry in some places you may want to put something right here even if it's a dummy block I'm not sure engineering of some sort I assume I need storage in here man who loves this black storage Looks like cargo area. Well done with the uh, the moved missile box all over the place. That's pretty cool. Um, let's see, med med bay, definitely med bay. You know how I know it's a good med bay though, because you can tell it's a freaking med bay. Good job here. Um, I would say have a have a chair somewhere uh, for the doctor or the the medic on duty tends to help just a little bit um, galley I assume 
sort of thing. So yeah, pretty good. Uh, I guess thruster blocks in this case for hot pads. That's what it looks like for me. Um, and then in here we've got a bathroom. Nice job there. Can't tell if these are showers or toilets, but whatever. It could be Omni. Like uh, what Ender did, I believe it was Ender. And we've got a... Uh, these look like power couplings of some sort. Really nicely done. Um, you may be able to add a wedge right across here. Just, I, I don't know. Maybe that's just personal preference and possibly a Tetra there. But it looks nice either way. Uh, let's see. Is there anything else that I'm missing? I don't think so. Yeah, pretty straightforward. Mm -hmm. Just jumps over here, okay. Um, it looks like a little bit of Penta Tetra work could be done here and there. Like right here, you can do these with Pentas and Tetras. Depends on the look that you're trying to go for, of course. And you can actually turn a corner on its side right here for this block. If you're not trying to go for Pentas and Tetras. Um, other than that, the only th other thing, and maybe it's just a pet peeve of mine, I, again, you can hide that particular camera if you'd like. Uh, but yeah, it's a nice, nice overall design. Yeah, I saw that room. Okay. Is there anything else that I may have missed? No. See, there's more detail in this one. So that level of detail in this. You know, break up the flat, you know, you have these big flat panels, so you can break those up a little bit and make them look a little bit better. Uh, or a little bit more interesting with some scaffolding and stuff laid on top of it, and it'll be really cool. But yeah, so this was the DFN Odysseus by uh, Flying Debris, and I hope he does see this. That being said, um, I think we're going to call it here for this one. Thanks for watching, and we will see you next time.